Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue while launching the game GTA 5 using the Epic Games Launcher. You are not able to launch the game. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. Let's start with the basic troubleshooting steps. First of all, if you have installed one drive into a system, you need to uninstall it. You can verify the same by clicking on this up arrow key and if one drive icon is available, you need to uninstall by right clicking on start menu and choose option run. Type here appwiz.cpl and then hit the enter key. Now here press the O key to find one drive and if it is available, select it and choose the option uninstall. After installing, close it. Now open up your window security. And one more thing friends, if you have installed any third party antivirus such as Avast, AVG, Norton, make sure you completely uninstall them. Then in your window security, click on the option virus and threat protection. Now click on the option manage settings. Go ahead and turn off the real time protection. Then again, go to the home, click on firewall and network protection and again turn off all these three options. Domain network, private network, as well as public network. Once you're done so, relaunch your Epic Games launcher and try to play the game to fix out the issue of GTA 5 notch launching using the Epic Games launcher. If this failed to work out, let's proceed with the second step. In second step, you need to open the game directory. My game is available in my J drive, games, GTA 5. Now in game directory, you will find GTA 5 files. These are all .exe files and right pane, you can see the application is written. So where application is written, right click on it, choose option properties, hit on compatibility tab and if this option is check mark, uncheck it and check mark the option run this program as an administrator. Hit apply and ok button. Do the same with all GTA 5 files. For example, GTA 5, GTA 5 battle I and play GTA 5. After doing these changes, close it. Now try to relaunch the game. And if this also failed to work out, last step is to head over to this PC. From the left pane, click on the option documents. Now in documents folder, you will find a folder with the name Rockstar Games. Go ahead, press the F2 key to rename it and give it a name Rockstar Games 123 and hit the enter key. One more thing friends, if the Rockstar Games launcher or the Epic Games launcher is running, you may not be able to rename this folder. So make sure before re renaming, you must close the launcher of Epic Games as well as Rockstar Games and then rename this particular folder. After renaming, simply restart your PC and relaunch the game and this will fix out the issue of GTA 5 not running using the Epic Games launcher. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.